Well, for the longest time, viewers have watched Ellen from 3 to 4 right here before our show at 9 News. But as you know, Ellen came to an end this year. And then starting a week from today, we're going to have a new show leading into us from 3 to 4 p.m. And we are lucky because our new lead in is done by our friends in the building. Daily Blast Live is a national show, but it's done every day right here in Denver. The show belongs to a smart, opinionated and diverse group of talented people who all like to say the show really belongs to you, the viewer. And while it has been on the early afternoons here on Channel 9 for the last few years, DBL, which is a much other way, easier way to refer to it, um, is moving to 3 p.m. So we're kind of excited about that. This week we're bringing in all the hosts to give you a better idea of who they are and who DBL is. So Sam Shocker is here with us today. Yay! Nice to see you in the afternoon. I keep, know. Keep you up late. Yeah, you are. You are. <laughs> yeah. So we, I think a lot of people don't get to see TV in midday and moving to 3 o'clock. You can expand your audience in Denver. Tell people what, what you think DBL is. Okay, so first and foremost, uh, we're so excited to move to 3 p.m. And, <laughs> and like, big deal right before y'all. So uh, DBL, nationally syndicated talk show, but what makes us different is we really do keep it real. We are completely unfiltered. We, to the point where if we have differences in opinion, which we all do, and mm -hmm. I think that's the best way to have a panel talk show is to have people from all walks of life, we get into it. Now, just because it gets heated, it doesn't mean that we don't love each other. In fact, we'll put it all out on the table and then we'll go have drinks afterwards. <laughs> but we put it all out on the table. I've seen it and it's, it's not like <laughs> it's it goes fun. off the rails, but it's it's a fun ride. It is, yeah. it's a fun ride. We cover everything you're talking about from politics to entertainment to everyday stuff, parenting, gun violence, all of it. Anything that you talk about, we talk about, but we also talk about really uncomfortable conversations. Mm -hmm. And I think that is what also puts us aside is we mm -hmm. will go there and we will unpack it with you. And we read all the comments and we care what our viewers think, big time. I love that because you do, you talk about the viewers and what they're saying about a specific topic and who they side with oh, and, yeah. and what, you know, who they are, Team Sam today. I hope it's Team Sam, yeah. <laughs> not Team Tom. Well, I don't you know. You never know about I lost Kathy today anyway. <laughs> so, um, but the whole thing is, like, you all moved here. Yes. How many years ago now? So we all moved here. My daughter, Sophie, was, oh, my gosh, like five weeks at the time. And we were all in Los Angeles. And I remember we packed up an RV, four cats, a dog, a <laughs> oh, newborn. Ew. We set up a tent in the back. We oh my stuffed word. all the cats in the tent in the RV. And it was not fun. But no, we are here. That was <laughs> off the rails. <laughs> that is off the rails. That was crazy. Off the grid. What do you, well, since everyone's moved here, you've had very similar experiences with your co-hosts. What are the favorite things you found about Colorado or the people Love. of Colorado? I never, ever in a million years thought I'd end up in Colorado. And I'm so, I thank my lucky stars every <laughs> night that I did. We love it here. And I think what we love to each kind of do is explore all the different mountain towns. And so that's what my family does. But I know Jeff's family, Jeff Schroeder, you guys know him from Big mm -hmm. Brother. Uh, he does the same thing. Tori and her husband, and we just did tubing in Golden fun, about a week ago. Fun. Yeah. Very fun. Careful of those rapids, <laughs> but it was really fun. So yeah, I know you had a big discussion about Grand Lake recently because oh Tori was going. I'm obsessed. <laughs> All these places. All these places. I, know. I love it. Way better than Los Angeles. Sorry, LA. No. <laughs> but you've had another baby too since you got I here. Did. Yeah, I had Miles. He's two and a half now. So Sophie was six weeks. Now she's five years old, starting kindergarten with Jeff's uh, son Lawson, and it's like. We all came here not knowing one another, globbed on to one another because we were each other's family. Right. And uh, yeah, and then here we are going into our sixth season. So grateful, thank you. And uh, yeah, like I said, I think the fact that we all have different backgrounds and different opinions and different political beliefs, but then all somehow respect and love one another, that should be the example today because we are way too divided this, in this country. Well, this yeah. is Sam's story. So, I mean, that you can Yeah, you might it. find something else from Jeff or Tori or Al or Erica, but I'm watching you guys. I'm <laughs> watching eyes you. on them. We are gonna have them on every day though. We're gonna, we're gonna bring someone on from DDL every day and hopefully give everyone a much better idea what the show's about yeah. and uh, what, what you are about. And it's been great to see you in the building and great to see you I this adore afternoon. you too. Thank oh, you for having so happy. me. This Thank is you great. for It'll all the support. Three to four, everybody. Don't forget to watch. We'll see you starting next next Monday, three o'clock. Right. Week One from week today, from DBL. today, you can catch DBL in its new time from three to four every Monday through Friday right here on Nine News. So it's going to be a big deal, Tom. Thanks, Sam. <laughs> Yay. Thanks,